Well, it is that time of year again. The Hokey Bug Fest returns for its seventh year. And joining us to talk about the event, we have Dr. Mike Weaver along with Tim McCoy. Hello. And you brought some friends. Of course we brought friends. Yeah. Okay. You know what? So, yeah. So, will you, first, let's talk about Hokey Bug Fest. This is um, the seventh year. And uh, okay. last year we had about 7,700 people. And we're expecting probably that many and more. Yeah. And uh, of course, you know, it, it ranges from our bug zoo, which we brought you part of, but yeah. we've got some strange ones this year. We, we actually had some of our um, uh, faculty and students go to Vietnam and pick up some, you know, millipedes and pill bugs and things that you won't see anywhere so else. So you all travel to, right. to get yeah. like new bugs? It's I part of our research that. projects. And, and so that one in particular will be interesting. And then We've got all, all the above. Tim's holding a, one of our local, actually it's a, a Chinese manid, so it's not really a local. Not necessarily but, local. Um, but we'll have things like that, but then we okay. have all our oddball things as well. So. Absolutely. The bug was waving at the camera earlier. Yeah. It was very cute. Oh, they're very inquisitive. They've got excellent vis vision. This uh, prey mantids are predators, so they've got very good vision. Okay. And so she can see all of us. She's oh. she's. Oh, looking hello. at you, hello. checking oh, on, and waving. It's hello. So waving. Hi, hi. Oh my goodness! Can you teach me? I kind of like oh, that one. I love oh my goodness! That one. Okay, I like that Seems one. Seems friendly. And this year that we're was... also having a bug eating contest. Yeah. Oh, you are. Yeah, yes. Great. And not we're not eating any. Oh, I hope not. She's so friendly. Yeah, yeah no, please don't. No. No. <laughs> but we're we're beating things like. Uh, what is that? Okay, that that's is a, a giant water giant bug. Giant water bug. And is, do pe why why do you do this? Is this something that people actually eat, or oh, is it just for around the kind of world? Fun? Lots of people okay. eat insects okay. uh, as part of their normal diet. Mm -hmm. We're doing it just as a more of isn't this cool? Yeah. And it's a little gross and exciting and generates some excitement. Yeah. Brittany and I are going to be eating scorpions. I'm pretty excited about that. Well, oh, yes. I'm excited for you guys too. You're going to have some too. Mm -mm. Okay. Mm -mm. All right. Um, <laughs> so let's talk about some of the attractions. Obviously, we have the bugs, but you all have like games and stuff that's there's, happening there's too. There's uh, an art room that we always have. Uh, so there's arts, crafts, there's contests, there's uh, the waggle, the waggle contest we have okay. every year. So you have to waggle to get a prize. Uh, bug bingo, things of that nature. We, uh, we start at, nine, at 10 o'clock, uh, but we have a special session at 9 o'clock for mm -hmm. children with autism. So oh, we'll have wonderful. quiet rooms, and those quiet rooms will be open mo throughout most of the day. Oh, that's wonderful. Uh, and then, um, you know, we, we've got a butterfly room this year that's new. Mm -hmm. uh, we, we have, of course, our uh, Alberti Flea Circus and, uh, and uh, Tony the, the Bug Whisperer is back, so we'll, we'll have that's fun great. with that. Oh, and okay. uh, so it's it fills the entire inn at Virginia Tech. I mean, we have every room. Filled well, there's in, a lot so of bugs. Two floors. World. So yeah. what I I want to know kind of what the what is the goal of this of the whole event? Because I mean, there are people like us who who have the initial fear of bugs. Right. So is kind of the goal to you know get rid of that and show like this is why they happen and this is what they. Well, yes. I mean, we, we actually, my, my grads, one of my grad students has uh, a project working with, with just that. But really? it, it, the whole uh, thrust of this thing is science literacy, promoting uh, discovery and, and uh, really, uh, you know, encouraging kids to engage with, and, and adults to engage with these things because they're all around us. Yeah. Uh, they're going to outlive us. Okay. And, uh, and they have, you know, they've been here before we were. And they're they're a very important part of our our ecosystem. So okay. uh, most insects and insect relatives are beneficial. And well, this most sounds like such a great event. So oh. I don't know if do you want to eat Who one of those scorpions? We have ten seconds, so we we are wrapping up. So yeah. if you're gonna open it up, and Joanna's gonna eat one. Uh, nope. We'll do it. Are they like flavored or something? Well, they're lightly roasted and salted. So lightly, you know, just like I like them. That's lightly <laughs> roasted and salted. Are they dangerous? Not at all. Well, Oops. Oh, he's oh, trying to get him. Mm. You go ahead and take uh, the one with the tail. Oh, the one with oh the one, one with right the there. tail. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I can do this. Yes, I really can. can. Um, what do you do? Do you do the whole thing? Yep, pop it in there. Okay. Ready? Okay. One, two. Do I chew it in chew right it away? Yep. Uh -huh. Okay. And while she chews that, two. 